Well, only on Fox tonight, nothing was going to stop an 80 year old Vietnam veteran from leaving his hospital bed to go and vote. Fox 26's Randy Wallace joins us live from downtown with the exclusive. Yes, yeah, Sherman. Now, this will more than likely be the last election Stan Toops will see. He went above and beyond to cast his final vote. I spent a career in the Air Force and retired, and I'm laying in this bed where I am now. Oh. We talked to Stan Toops, a Vietnam veteran, from his hospital bed at Houston Methodist in the medical center. Well, found out recently I got cancer. I have kidney cancer that has drifted into the bone, and I'm told into parts of my brain, too. His prognosis is not, you know, very good. He won't be here for the next... Hopefully, he'll be here Christmas. You were bound and determined that you were going to vote. Yes, sir. Stan asked his second cousin to find the closest voting location. He says, oh, and he walked over to the corner of the big window in front of me and says, it's right down there underneath that flagpole. He put it together to get me in a wheelchair and get me over there. Well, I had on my, my initial hospital gown, and they went and found me another one and put it on backwards so that things would show. First uh, ballot, it just the machine ate it, so he they had to call the county and reissue another number and everything. And all of a sudden, the fire alarm went off, and they, they, they started getting people out of the building. Well, I'm in a wheelchair, and I just kept voting. I just kept voting. And everybody got out of the room, and they kept saying, you got to get out here. I said, I'm going to vote. And my cousin kept saying, just keep voting. As so many men have died for, and women have died for, for that freedom. Um, and it's a, it's a privilege. It's an honor. He can get up out of his hospital bed and uh, be willed over there then hopefully people will get up off their sofas and go vote. Yeah, if you think life is making it too hard for you to go vote, remember Stan Toops. Reporting live from downtown, Randy Wallace, Fox 26 News.